Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to my channel, my name is Mr. Lawrence and in today's video I will show you the 3 easiest duffel bags to get in GT5 Online. This works on our platforms and it's completely solo. But before we begin, check out Hyper Resupply, they provide multiple GTA services such as modded accounts, money and rank boosts for all platforms. They are cheap, fast and reliable. Don't forget to use my code Lawrence at checkout for a 10% discount. The link will be in the description below, so check them out and let's get straight into the video. First I will show you how to get the black duffel bag, get in the back of your terror bite and access the screen. Then go to client jobs and start robbery in progress. Now access the screen again and scroll through the cameras till you find the bank where the cops are at. Then just make your way over to the bank, shoot everyone and also shoot some rockets inside the bank before you go in because there's a juggernaut inside. Now grab the duffel bag and lose the cops. You can also call Lester to remove your wanted level. When you did that, make your way over to the yellow marker on the map. You will need to be up in the air, cause we will need to parachute right into the yellow halo. You will also get like 30k and from here make your way over to the emanation. Go to the parachutes, parachute bags and purchase the Israel parachute bag. Equip the parachute and make your way over to the mask store with a flying vehicle. Then parachute right into the mask store and start spamming right on the d-pad so you can save this outfit in the mask store. Now equip the saved outfit to get your duffel bag. The only downside is that you can't change your outfit, so you will need to take the easy way out to be able to change your outfit. Now I will show you how to get blue, yellow and red duffel bags, so pretty much 3 in 1. You will be able to change your outfits with these duffel bags. To get them, start the diamond casino heist in your arcade. Just complete the scope out mission and the vault contents. When you completed them, make sure you select the big gun approach. Then go to the prep board and select any gunman, driver and hacker. Now go down to the prep missions. If you want the blue duffel bag, start the prep mission Noose Gear. If you want the yellow duffel bag, start Vault Rails. And if you want the red one, start the second Buckstars Gear mission. So select this prep and go once to the right, it's called Maintenance Gear. We will use the same method for all these duffel bags, so just start one. You will probably need to eliminate a couple enemies, then grab the first bag and deliver it to your arcade. Now grab the second bag and you will need to have a flying vehicle, because we will need to parachute right into the yellow marker at our arcade. So just like this and when you are inside go back outside and go to the ammunition. Now go to parachutes, parachute bags and purchase the Israel parachute bag. Equip the parachute and make your way over to the mask store with a flying vehicle. Then parachute right into the mask store and start spamming right on the d-pad to access the mask store. If you did it correctly, you can now save your outfit. Now equip the outfit to get your duffel bag and you can also switch between your saved outfits. So if you want the other colored duffel bags, just do the same method but start a different prep mission. Lastly, I will show you how to transfer duffel bags onto other outfits. First equip the outfit that you want the duffel bag on. Then equip a parachute and save your outfit in any slot. Now equip an outfit with the duffel bag that you want to transfer. Get on or in a flying vehicle and fly up. Then jump off or out, open your parachute and equip the outfit that you saved with a parachute. 
When you land and your character takes off the parachute, the duffel bag will be on this outfit. Now to save it, fly up again, then parachute into the mask store and spam right on the d-pad when you land. If you did it correctly, you can now save this outfit again. Hopefully you enjoyed today's video and I will catch you in the next one. Bye bye.